I'm Tom for DIY Life Tech, and this is an answer to the question of how to power your Ring video doorbell. So you have two options with most Ring video doorbells. One is a battery-powered operation, and the doorbell has a battery that's sort of embedded inside of the bottom part of the doorbell here. And it's a pretty beefy battery. Um, you can go for up to uh, a month or two, depending on the conditions, how often your doorbell gets used, um, certainly several weeks of operation using that battery. Um, and then you simply pop it out of the doorbell and you recharge it um, using a, uh, it's like a little USB connection. Um, so that's one option, the uh, battery powered option. The other option is to have the doorbell hardwired. So if you have an existing doorbell transformer or you get one installed, um, this can run off the low voltage from that and that lets it run indefinitely. You don't have to change out the battery on there. Um, it's powered by your existing transformer. And um, you can look into the specific transformers that do and don't work. You can visit the Ring uh, doorbell website and get a list there. Um, and one caveat with that is if you're going to install it that way, you may need to get an electrician to do that install for you, depending on the area you live. Some places require permits for any kind of electrical work, even something that simple. So check with your own jurisdiction. Um, just for peace of mind, I got an electrician to install mine. It was a very, very simple procedure, um, basically just connecting some wires up to the back of the doorbell, and now it is continuously powered on that hardwired connection. And the nice thing is the battery is still in there. The hardwired connection will keep that battery charged up, and that way if there's um, ever you know a power failure or something, as long as your Wi-Fi is still operating, your internet's still operating, and the doorbell will run off of that uh, internal battery during that power failure, you can still get a stream of um, the video from your doorbell. So it's nice to have that battery backup uh, built in there. And again, um, those are your two options. You know, battery powered operation, be ready to charge it every couple of weeks, up to a couple months, depending on how your, uh, your uh, ring doorbell gets used. Or, um, you know, get it hardwired. And uh, if you have the appropriate uh, existing hardwired connection for an old doorbell, for example, um, then you can basically use this for as long as uh, as you want to, um, and it will stay powered on that hardwired connection right from your home.